Uh, give me back my compliment. Wait a second. Um, maybe I was too harsh with what I said earlier. <laughs> so the anime starts off with Takashi reminiscing about how Asuna was supposed to be his, but side character Kun got to her first. And then this Sundaria girl comes up. You know what? We're gonna call them spicy Latinas around here. Every time I mention a Sundaria, it's a spicy Latina. Got a flash in this lingo. She just comes out of nowhere, starts killing bro vibe. I mean, you're pretty stupid, but at least you know you are. So if I tell you that you're stupid, maybe by some miracle you'll be less stupid stupid damn it's only first period and he's getting cooked like this high school did used to be a wild time people used to walk around in the morning eating a hot chip fighting and girls Maybe yelling at you like this and it's not even 9 a.m yet she keep talking to me like this i might have to change this anime into berserk but then he notices that zombie stuff starts happening at the front gate and the first thing on his mind is asuna so he rushes to the class to tell everybody what's going on and then this teacher just starts doing unnecessary meat riding well takashi this is the first of you come into my class. Whenever you do, you skip my class. Have you even did your homework? I'll make sure to snitch on you to your parents at parent-teacher conference. Sir, I can't even see you on the screen, and I understand why he doesn't go to your classroom. So he goes over to take Asuna out of the classroom, and then she starts spazzing too. What's going on? I can never understand. Bro wasn't trying to hear all of that yelling. He had to put her in her place. I understand what's going <laughs> What's more crazy about this scene is that her boyfriend was standing right there. You just gonna let him grab your girl like that? You just gonna let him put your girl in check like that? So everybody just starts freaking out. So Takashi, Asuna, and look, look at your hair. We both know you're not making it past this first episode, so I'm not gonna remember your name, pal. So Asuna starts struggling against the zombie, and then here comes Captain Savaho. Okay, look at Asuna. Every time you see an Asuna type of anime girl, you know that they know how to handle themselves. Uh, give me back my compliment wait a second um maybe i was too harsh with what i said earlier <laughs> don't worry i have a black belt in karate what the f no <laughs> chaos is erupting everywhere this is no laughing matter let go of me damn it bitch i said let go <laughs> I'm gonna be honest with you, I'm doing exactly what bro's doing. Now, when I was younger, I probably would have thought zombies was cool. But bro, I'm not eating beans for the rest of my life. I'm not walking around having mold grow on my balls because I haven't showered in seven months. Then I remember I had this insane Xbox conversation late at night once too. My mans was like, shit, if we had a zombie apocalypse, if some females ask for some water, I'm gonna say how bad you want it. And I'm gonna make sure she chained up too when it's happening so she don't uh so she don't try anything. The whole part party went quiet i just came out and said this guy's a ra anyways got a flash and the story time over by the way shout out to whoever was directing this anime bro really had the vision so side character kun turns into a zombie after all then takashi is like damn i guess i gotta kill him and take his girl too ah this is terrible so after when all that happened she calls her dad and he can't hear her because they got flip phones so you know how that goes he didn't know that it was me at all he didn't even know me. He didn't recognize you because he didn't have service. Who's writing this dialogue because... Oh, brother, this guy stinks! So this nurse is about to get eaten, and goddamn, these Japanese artists are too damn horny. Why are they that big? You can feed a house with those. More. Every homeless person in the city with those. More. Matter of fact, a country. More! Damn, she can end world hunger with those. But then she gets saved by this cool Japanese girl. But as I watched her in every scene, she gave off a little bit of Toji energy. The guy that got bit trying to save the nurse, she killed him, no hesitation. Then when more zombies came, she started smiling. Niggas think I'm fighting to save the day. But really, nigga, I just like to fight. So the spicy Latinas with the, hey, I'm not fat, I'm actually big bone guy. And it feels like every chance she gets, she starts cooking him. Let's go, chubby. Only reason I have to stay with this dumbass is because Kamoro. God, you're fat and stupid. So they get in his weapon shop and start doing some dead rising weapon customization. Then he just makes the most devious school shooter grin I've ever seen. I'm not stuck in here with you guys. You guys are stuck in here with me. That water hose reminds me of the first time I watched this as a kid. I remember watching the bathtub episode. I hopped in the shower and started beating my meat to it with soap. Yeah, that burned like hell. I didn't touch myself for like over a year after that. God, a flash in this lore. So the main characters finally link up with each other and then they start helping out some side characters. Oh, 
dog. We finna head out. Y'all trying to come? Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. We're safe. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You know the drill. Gas or ass. I'm not saving y'all out the kindness of my heart. Either you give me brain or you give the zombies brain. Pick one. And then they finally make it to a bus. We're not letting her on the bus. Bitch, we letting her on the bus. <laughs> 